I'm so effective in shutting you down tonight. Uh, the, you know, number one, they just uh, they play hard start to finish. They use their speed. They took away time and space. And, um, you know, again, scored the first one. You, you got to continue to dig in and work hard. And, you know, again, tip your cap. I mean, to me, I, they were the better team tonight. That five on three in the second, was that really the, the critical point of the game? Well, I mean, certainly, I mean, we had obviously a couple great looks at a couple posts. I mean, sometimes you, uh, you know, sometimes you get those, sometimes you don't. I mean, we go up two zip, maybe it's a different game, but it didn't happen. So then you got to respond from there. Coach, what, um, sorry, I got my question. Freddie. <laughs> Um, you guys only had four shots in the third period. What was what was making it so difficult to get shots on net in that final period? Um, well, I think you know we kind of uh, played into what they like to do. You know, we kind of we would get pucks deep, and then we wouldn't have really a, established a four check. We'd kind of send one guy, and then he'd get beat, you know, with a chip or one pass. And F two and F three would kind of be caught in no man's land. And you know, they had a lot of heat coming up the ice on us. And for whatever reason, we just didn't really have the jump tonight. We weren't playing really connected, and so it was, it's definitely something we want to try and fix for tomorrow because it's uh, not how we want to be playing and what worked so well in that that goal to start the game uh, I mean it was just kind of a you know good play come up the ice by Dakota and Carson and you know good pass by Carson to find me on the back side it just kind of right place right time and I had the easy job just to you know tap it in coach because Michigan's been kind of inconsistent all year was there something like unexpected about how they played today was it just anything you saw differently in this team no same thing I said uh, the other day to you guys they're they're a really good hockey team they got a ton of talent they play North South, they play with a lot of speed. There's nothing, there's nothing that surprised me tonight. Freddie, a big crowd tonight. It seemed like they were waiting for something that to cheer about. Mm -hmm. You weren't able to give it to maybe in the latter parts of the game. They didn't seem to get you guys going. Just how frustrating was that? There wasn't that big, you know, roar out of the crowd tonight. I mean, it, it, it's 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 on us, really. I mean, uh, anytime you know, this was one of the better crowds that I've ever seen since being here. You know, and um, it's unfortunate that we weren't really able to get the job done for them. I mean, we, the support was awesome. It was great to see the you know our building packed like it was tonight, and you know, and uh, hopefully you know next time we can get the win for them and get get it done. Yeah, I just got to say the the crowd was incredible. Mm -hmm. I mean, you walk out here and see ten thousand people and. Um, you know, I don't know, close to almost 3,000 students. Uh, that tells you where Ohio State hockey is. And, and uh, just disappointing we didn't get to uh, keep them on their feet enough. But I'll tell you, if they keep coming back, hopefully we'll get them back on their feet again. Uh, Coach, is there any update on Gustav Westland's injury? Uh, he's just day-to-day -day right now. Um, you know, so we'll kind of see where it goes right now. So do you expect him to appear tomorrow? I, uh, we'll kind of figure out where he's at again tomorrow. All right. You guys good? Thanks, you guys. Yeah, thank Appreciate you guys. it.